So well, hi there, this is another video from me. It's a, an AM transmitter and it's another one transistor circuit, but this is pretty much the best one that I built until now, or until so far, let's say, let's better say that, because this transmitter circuit, as I said, uses only one transistor. There's nothing that you have to align, unlike on my other transmitters, or many of my other transmitters, and it works just perfectly. My friend Iflose, I sent a schematic to him and he rebuilt it. Here you can see his uh, name. It would be neat if you subscribe to him. Um, he has rebuilt it and here you can see the complete uh, schematic of this transmitter. It's really power saving. <laughs> you can trust me. It uses a standard NPN transistor like 2N3904 or BC547. And this coil you can either use as I am doing it. Uh, I'm using two coils in series which are already pre-made. But you can also wrap some wire around a AA battery with some paper between it, and then you can pull the wire with the co you can pull the coil from the battery, and then you have a transmitting coil. It will tr cover one feet with a good radio of transmission range, and therefore also in most countries it should, in theory, be legal. That means you don't need a license for broadcasting with this thing. Um, in, the, in his video he is showing really every step how you can build this transmitter from starting, showing you how to build the PCB, or better, not PCB, it's not a PCB, how to build the circuit board, how to build the coil, wind some wire, wire on the coil, showing the schematic, explaining how the transmitter works, uh, creating the circuit board with these devices, soldering the components, he shows every component that has been soldered to the circuit board and explains it. And at the end of the video he even tests the transmitter and sees that it works. Uh, already a, a couple of people have rebuilt the transmitter and everyone that rebuilt it got it working. The only complaints I, re I received was the low range, but I, I intended this thing to be low power because as I said before, in theory then it should be in most countries license free. That means you don't need a license for broadcasting with it. And also it's inductive transmission, that means the coil is generating a magnetic field which is picked up by this radio, which also uh, enforces the, the device being in theory legal. Let's have a short listen on the audio quality of this transmitter. The audio quality of course is quite good. Now for those who know what I'm talking about, I'm showing you that it has good AM. I'm tuning over the band. So for those who are, who are as, as experienced as I am, uh, let's pause it. For those who are ex as experienced as I am, you can tell by what you heard that this, tran this, this transmitter really is generating a good AM signal. So yeah, that's a simple one transistor, especially good for beginners or those who need a quick test transmitter on medium wave or a medium wave modulator to, to broadcast a signal to their vintage radio or their, that's not so vintage, but it's rather an old radio. You can build this transmitter. And of course, it would be nice if you would subscribe to Iflos' channel. Best regards and have a nice day, Stefan.